Senator Amidala, please. Must I remind the senator from Malister that negotiations are continuing with the separatists. Peace is our objective here, not war. My noble colleagues, less than an hour ago, an assassination attempt was made against my life. One of my bodyguards and six others were ruthlessly and senselessly murdered. I was the target, but more importantly, the security measure before you was the target. I have led the opposition to building this army. And someone will stop at nothing to assure its passage. Wake up, Senators. You must wake up. If you offer the Separatists violence, they can only show violence in return. Many will lose their lives. All will lose their freedom. I pray you do not let fear push you into disaster. Vote down the security measure, which is nothing less than a declaration of war. Does anyone here want that? I cannot believe they do. Due to the lateness of the hour and the seriousness of this motion, we will take up these matters tomorrow. Until then, the Senate is adjourned. I don't know how much longer I can hold off the vote, my friends. More and more star systems are joining the separatists. Place a subject for analysis on the sensor tray, please. It's a toxic dart. I need to know where it came from and who made it. One moment, please. Markings cannot be identified. As you can see on your screen, Subject weapon does not exist in any known culture. Probably self-made by a warrior, not associated with any known society. Stand away from the sensor tray, please. Thank you for your assistance. I know who can identify this. Obi-Wan! Hello, Dex. Take a seat, I'll be right with you. You want a cup of jaw with you? Oh, yes, thank you. <laughs> did you call for assistance? Yes, yes, I did. Ah, he has a very powerful face, doesn't he? He was one of the most brilliant Jedi I've had the privilege of knowing. I never understood why he quit. Well, one might say he was always a bit out of step with the decisions of the Council. Much like your old master, Kwai Kon Jin. Really? Oh, yes, they were very individual thinkers. Idealists. In the end, I think he left because he lost faith in the Republic. He disappeared for nine or ten years and turned up recently as head of the separatist movement. It's very interesting. I'm not sure I completely understand. <laughs> well, you didn't call me over here for a history lesson. Are you having a problem, Master Kenobi? Yes, um, I'm looking for a planetary system called Kamina. When I first started my training, I was very homesick, very lonely. But I'd always feel better when I thought about the palace, the way it shimmers in the sunlight. The way the air always smells of flowers. And the soft sound of the distant waterfalls. When I first saw the capital, I was very young. I had never seen a waterfall before. I thought they were so beautiful. 
I never dreamed that one day I'd be living in the palace. Well, tell me, did you dream of power and politics when you were a little girl? No, that was the last thing I thought of. I wasn't the youngest queen ever elected, but now that I think back on it, I'm not sure I was old enough. I'm not sure I was ready. The people you served thought you did a good job. I heard they even tried to amend the Constitution so you could stay in office. Popular rule is not democracy, Annie. It gives the people what they want, not what they need. I was relieved when my two terms were up. So were my parents. They were very worried about me during the blockade. They couldn't wait for it all to be over. Actually, I had hoped to have a family of my own by now. My sister has the most amazing, wonderful kids. But when the queen asked me to serve as senator, I couldn't refuse her. I agree with her. I think the Republic needs you. I'm glad that you chose to serve. It appears someone doesn't want us to know about this Camino system. Which means there's something happening on that system that we should know about. Master, do you think a Jedi could have erased those files? I hope not. But this disturbance in the Force is making it hard to get a sense of things. I'm concerned for my Padawan. He is not ready to be on his own. If the prophecy is true, he is the one who will bring balance to the Force. But he still has much to learn. I realize now what you and Master Yoda knew from the beginning. The boy was too old to start his training. Master, we should not have been given this assignment. I fear Anakin will not be able to protect the Senator. Why? He has an emotional connection with her. It's been there since he was a boy. Now he's confused. Distracted. Obi-Wan, you must have faith that he will choose the right path. Yes, Master. votes to create an army, I'm sure it's going to push us into a civil war. It's unthinkable. There hasn't been a full-scale war since the formation of the Republic. Do you see any way through negotiations to bring the Separatists back into the Republic? Not if they feel threatened. My guess is they'll turn to the Trade Federations or the Commerce Guilds for help. It's outrageous. But after four trials in the Supreme Court, Newt Gunray is still the Viceroy of the Trade Federation. I fear the Senate is powerless to resolve this crisis. We must keep our faith in the Republic. The day we stop believing democracy can work is the day we lose it. Let's pray that day never comes. In the meantime, we must consider your own safety. What is your suggestion, Master Jedi? Oh, Anakin's not a Jedi yet. He's still a Padawan learner, but I was thinking... Hold on a minute. Excuse me. I was thinking I would stay in the lake country. There's some places up there that are very isolated. Excuse me. I'm in charge of security here, milady. And this is my home. I know it very well. That is why we're here. I think it would be wise if you took advantage of my knowledge in this instance. I'm sorry, milady. Perfect. It's settled then. We're here. This is my house. Brew!
in May. <laughs> I'm worried. Anakin, this is my sister, Sola. Hello, Anakin. Hello. And this is my mother. Hello. You made it just in time for dinner. I hope you're hungry, Anakin. A little. He's being polite, Mom. We're starving. Well, you've come to the right place at the right time. Oh, honey, it's so good to see you safe. We were so worried. Dear. I know, I know. But I had to say it. Now it's done. Did you know, Anakin, you're the first boyfriend my sister's ever brought home? He's not my boyfriend. Anakin's a friend. We've known each other for years. He's a Jedi assigned to me by the Senate to protect me. A bodyguard? Oh, Padme, they didn't tell us it was that serious. It's not, I promise. I'm not in any danger, Mom. Is she? Yes, um, I'm afraid she is. I sometimes wish that uh, I'd travel more, but uh, I must say I'm, I'm very happy here. Padme tells me you teach at the university. Yeah, yeah, before that I was a, I was a builder. <laughs> I also work for a, uh, a freedom relief movement, but I was very young. Why haven't you told us about him? What's there to talk about? He's just a boy. A boy? Have you seen the way he looks at you? Sola, stop it. It's obvious he has feelings for you. Anakin and I are friends. Our relationship is strictly professional. So tell me, son. How serious is this thing? How much danger is my daughter really in? There have been two attempts on her life. Chances are there'll be more. <sighs> my master's tracking down the assassins. I'm sure he'll find out who they are. The situation won't last long. I don't want anything to happen to her. I don't either. So you still live at home? I move around so much. Never had a place of my own. Official residences have no warmth. I feel good here. I feel at home. Never really had a home. Home was always where my mom was. Hmm. Is this you? That was when I went with the relief group. Their sun was imploding and the planet was dying. I was helping relocate all the children. See that little one I'm holding? His name was Naki Tula, which means sweetheart. He was so full of life. They all were. They were never able to adapt, to live off their native planet. They all died. My first day as an apprentice legislator. That was the difference. You're holding a Jedi Knight, Obi-Wan Kenobi. I'm formally requesting you hand him over to me now. We don't recognize the Republic here, Senator. But if Naboo were to join our alliance, I could easily hear your plea for clemency. And if I don't join your rebellion? The Republic cannot be fixed, my lady. It is time to start over. I know of your treaties with the Trade Federation, the Commerce Guilds, and the others count. I will not forsake all I have honored and worked for and betray the Republic. Without your cooperation, I've done all I can for you. You're committing an act of war, Archduke. I hope you're prepared for the consequences. Get on with it! Carry out the sentence! I want to see her suffer! 
Don't be afraid.